Signs that a woman has not been sexually active. It can be challenging to determine whether a person is sexually active or not. However, some signs can let you know if a woman has engaged in sexual activity or not. These warning signals can include things like lack of sex confidence, unwillingness to engage in sexual activity, and general lack of interest in sex. It can be challenging to determine whether a person is sexually active or not. However, some signs can let you know if a woman has engaged in sexual activity or not. These warning signals can include things like lack of sex confidence, unwillingness to engage in sexual activity, and general lack of interest in sex. What is sexual inactivity and why is it important? Sexual inactivity is the absence of sexual participation between an individual and their partner. It is important to note that sexual activity differs from person to person and there is no universal standard for a normal amount of sex. However, going for extended periods without sexual activity can lead to several changes in the body, including physical and emotional changes. One physical change that can occur due to sexual inactivity is a decrease in vaginal lubrication in women. This can lead to discomfort or pain during sexual activity when it does occur. Additionally, sexual inactivity can also lead to a decrease in testosterone levels in men, which can result in a decrease in muscle mass and bone density. Emotionally, sexual inactivity can lead to feelings of loneliness, frustration, and even depression. It can also cause strain on relationships, as sexual intimacy is an important aspect of many romantic partnerships. However, it is important to note that sexual inactivity is not always a choice, and there are many reasons why someone may not be sexually active, such as illness, disability, or personal choice. The science behind how our bodies react to sexual inactivity. Our bodies are wired to engage in sexual activity. When we don't have sex for extended periods, our bodies start to experience changes, both physically and emotionally. Studies have shown that sexual inactivity can lead to a decrease in libido, sexual desire, and arousal. Hormones like testosterone also decrease, leading to reduced sexual interest. How long can a woman go without sex before experiencing changes in her body? The duration of sexual inactivity that leads to changes in your body varies from person to person. However, Studies have suggested that women who go longer than six months without sex can begin to experience emotional and physical changes in their bodies. One of the emotional changes that women may experience is a decrease in libido or sexual desire. This can be due to a decrease in the production of hormones such as testosterone and estrogen, which are responsible for sexual arousal. Additionally, Women who go without sex for extended periods may also experience feelings of loneliness, anxiety, and depression. Physical and Emotional Signs of Sexual Inactivity in Women Women who have not engaged in sexual activity for an extended period may experience physical and emotional changes. Some of the most common physical signs of sexual inactivity in women include vaginal dryness, decreased libido, and painful intercourse, Emotionally, sexual inactivity can lead to a lack of confidence, anxiety, and stress. In addition to the physical and emotional signs mentioned above, sexual inactivity in women can also lead to a weakened pelvic floor. This can result in urinary incontinence, which can be embarrassing and uncomfortable. Women who have not engaged in sexual activity for a long time may also experience a decrease in natural lubrication which can make sexual activity uncomfortable or even painful. It is important to note that sexual inactivity does not necessarily mean a lack of sexual desire or attraction. Some women may choose to abstain from sexual activity for personal or religious reasons, while others may experience barriers such as physical disabilities or mental health issues. Regardless of the reason, it is important for women to prioritize their sexual health and seek medical advice if they experience any physical or emotional discomfort related to sexual inactivity. How sexual inactivity can affect your mental health Sexual inactivity can have a profound impact on a woman's mental health. It can lead to anxiety and depression, as well as lower self-esteem and self-worth. It is essential to understand that sexual abstinence is a personal choice, but it's essential to recognize the potential effects it may have on your mental health.
Can you become uninterested in sex if you go for a long time without it? Yes, going for a long time without sexual activity can lead to a decrease in libido and sexual interest. Your body may adjust to the absence of sexual activity, leading to a reduced desire for sex. It's essential to note that this is not the case for everyone, and some individuals may experience an increase in sexual desire after extended periods of abstinence. There are several factors that can contribute to a decrease in sexual interest after a long period of abstinence. For example, stress, anxiety, and depression can all affect your libido and make you less interested in sex. Additionally, certain medications and medical conditions can also impact your sexual desire. Tips for women to revive their sexual life after a period of inactivity. If you are looking to revive your sex life after a period of inactivity, Several tips can help you get back on track. Communication is key when it comes to sexual activity and talking to your partner about your desire can reignite the flame. You can also try new things like exploring your fantasies, trying different positions, or introducing sex toys into the bedroom. It's essential to take things slow, be patient with yourself and your partner, and remember that sex should be enjoyable. Another tip to revive your sexual life is to focus on self-care, Taking care of your physical and mental health can increase your libido and make you feel more confident in the bedroom. This can include exercising regularly, eating a healthy diet, and practicing stress, reducing activities like yoga or meditation. Lastly, it's important to address any underlying issues that may be affecting your sex life. This could include relationship problems, hormonal imbalances, or medical conditions. Seeking help from a therapist or healthcare provider can help you identify and address these issues, leading to a healthier and more satisfying sex life. Exploring other forms of intimacy when you're not having sex. Intimacy is not just about sexual activity. Other forms of intimacy, such as cuddling, hugging, kissing, and holding hands, can help maintain emotional intimacy when sexual activity is not possible. It's crucial to explore these other forms of intimacy with your partner and prioritize what works best for both of you. Additionally, engaging in activities together, such as cooking, exercising, or taking a walk, can also foster intimacy and strengthen your bond. Communication is key in exploring these alternative forms of intimacy, as it allows you to understand each other's needs and desires. Remember, intimacy is not just physical, but also emotional and mental, and it's important to prioritize all aspects of intimacy in your relationship. The Benefits of Being Celibate why some women choose to stay sexually inactive? While well, celibacy is not for everyone, some women choose to abstain from sex for personal, cultural, or religious reasons. Celibacy can have several benefits, including self-discovery, personal growth, and a closer relationship with oneself. It's important to respect an individual's celibacy decision and understand that sexual activity is not a requirement to lead a fulfilling life. One of the benefits of celibacy is the ability to focus on personal goals and aspirations without the distraction of a sexual relationship. This can lead to increased productivity and a greater sense of accomplishment. Additionally, celibacy can provide a sense of empowerment and control over one's own body and choices. However, it's important to note that celibacy is not a one-size-fits-all solution and may not be the right